Please remove your datapad from the transfer socket. Transfer socket is what I call my redacted. Well, greetings, friends, and prepare for adventure as we return to the outer worlds. Uh, what did we do last week? We got some exciting new guns, uh, particularly the euthanasia kit uh, and the plasma carbine. Uh, just new best friends, best friends forever. Also, uh, an assault rifle that does really strong damage. Uh, we've still got a Deadeye assault rifle for some of the old long-range headshot stuff. But whereas before this was like, this was the the key piece in my arsenal. Now it's the like pretty much it's the weakest gun I have. So well, no, not well. The uh, the rate of fire on the blah blah blah. Let's not argue about gun statistics. Uh, that's it's not this kind of channel. But anyway, uh, new guns, mm, delicious. We also did some busy work um, in order to get uh, two sides to just shut up on the radio. Um, they wouldn't stop broadcasting, uh, and we've managed to convince both of them uh, to, to, to stop it so that we can now uh, talk to the broker and use the radio doodad to uh, try and get in touch with the person who can give us the chemicals to get everybody from the ship. I swear, every week it feels like a, a new round of, like, there was an old woman who swallowed a fly. She swallowed the, the spider to catch the fly, swallowed the cat... No, bird catch the spider and a cat to catch the bird. The tree in the branch and the branch in the hole and the hole down in the valley oh or the rattling bog the bog down in the valley oh you know like it's, it's one of those but let's uh, let's crack on shall we this uh this adventure is not gonna have itself is it let's uh let's go see the brokerman what we got in here That's nothing me. oh pavati i just love her she is so great yes i'll take some ammo do i want this helmet i will break it down Thank you. Okie dokie. Ooh! Yeah, Marauders, I remember. Oopsie. Wrong button. Plain and pure water. Okie dokie, right. Where's he gone? Up the stairs. Yep, that's another person we killed. Ah, it's nice to be back, isn't it? Right. Hello! Hear, hear him, hear him. Do you hear that? No. It's the blessed sound of radio silence. Very good. Which leads me to believe you have sweet, sweet news for me. I do. You bet your sweet, sweet bippy. Yes, indeed. Oh, sorry. I that am was... back in business. Sorry, I forgot but to read But before we get no. down to it, might I ask how you handled the problem? In the end? Uh, Does it matter? Job's done. Hmm, is that so? Yeah, I was, I was telling him that I'd managed to get uh, MSI and the Iconoclast to uh, stop broadcasting. And uh, he's asked me how I got it done, and I'm going to say that I... Oh, you're an information broker. If you want to know, it'll cost you. Yeah. Oh, I believe it will. But the price I pay won't be to you. No, we've a bigger deal to settle. Okay. I don't doubt that you are working with Phineas, but my yes. contract specifies I relay any acquired information to the purchaser, and to the purchaser alone. However, to send the data, I will need your assistance in cycling the antenna's receiver so I can input the needed adjustments. Mm -hmm. uh, Phineas doesn't trust many people. How did he hook up with you? Or fine, tell me how to fix it. Or three, I bet I have a and I bet I have a whole new checklist of crap to do before it works right. Or running the station is your job. Do it yourself. Let's say I bet I have a whole new checklist of crap to do before it works. Oh, don't be ridiculous. We're resetting a broadcast tower, not filing taxes. There are no errands, spreadsheets, or rituals involved. It's simple, truly. I merely need you to waltz outside and throw the lever to cycle the power. Mm. I'll key in the numerical adjustments from in here. That does sound very simple. That's it? You're not pulling my leg? Someone has trust issues. Yes. Though I can't hardly feign surprise. Mm. Yes, that is all. No, I am not mocking you. Much. Just... Step outside, flip the switch, depart forever. Understood? Good. Marvelous. We're in agreement. Fine. This is why I stopped helping out around here, you know. It's always throw this lever, shoot that marauder, save my life. Just one thing after another with you. 
If that's really all, let's just get it done with and be on our way. Got it. Terrific. I'll be here, waiting with bated breath. Give a shout if the panel electrocutes you. This guy's a jerkwad. I'm gonna break his toss ball stick. Yeah, 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 yeah. Trans transfer to Devil's Peak Relay. Ooh, it's pretty out here. Making that weird noise. A bypass shunt? Don't mind if I do. Thanks. Alright. I still kind of don't trust him. Or trust that this is going to be as simple as he claims. But we may as well throw the switch and find now. Here we go. Use. Testing one, two, check, check. Sweet stars. But that is a beautiful sound. Can you hear me? We are a go for broadcast. Great. Oh, and I also dispatched Phineas his data. Impatient prick. Worse, I'm now indebted to him for it. Now I'll kindly thank you to get out of my tower. Don't make me come back in there. There's no need to assert your dominance. I doubt I could make you do anything you don't wish to. Look, I am well aware that at times I may have the tiniest iota of a prickly exterior. I must admit, I have grown rather fond of you. Oh. As Nioka can attest, I do not form attachments with many. Do take care. Why, he told us to leave without flinging insults at our persons. He really does like you, Captain. This is quite nice. Oh, boy blasted hell is that? Oh, shit. I knew it wasn't going to be simple. Oh, shit. That wasn't the unreliable, was it? Black holes. Did you see that? Felix? Whose ship was that? Okay, well, it's not mine then. The big ball of fire? No, totally missed it. Let's just say whose ship was that. He's just he's just opened up to us. We can cut him a little bit of slag. Looks like a UDL ship. Based on the gunnery attachments, I guess it's one of the board's blockade enforcers, but uh -oh. don't cite me on that. Oh well, a pity for the crew, but I can't see how it affects me. Hiram? Can you hear me? Did you see that? Architect saved me from swindlers and fools. Sanjar, what are you bloody doing on my channel? Did MSI or did MSI not cease broadcasting? Yes, but... Hiram. Hiram, are you oh, there? Oh, God. This is bad. This feels very bad. Also, like... The broker being like, I don't see how this affects me. That's a bored blockade ship. They're not going to take that lightly. Oh, it's a... Okay, so I can either say, will someone explain what's going on? Oh, it's a reunion group hug, or I really should have just killed all of you. I'm going to say it's a reunion. Group hug! Not without a physical contact waiver. Ugh. Ah, the good captain. The truth brings us together once more. Our salvation has come crashing through the stratosphere. We need only collect its weapons. Hmm. Are you mad? That's a UDL gunship. You'd probably shoot your own toes off. You're acting like children. Par for the course, really. You should do like I did. Get out while you still retain a shred of sanity. Mm. We could use the gunship's armaments to defend Stellar Bay, but we need its targeting module. <sighs> Our message is so close to breaking free of this planet and spreading to the stars. Help us secure that module and we will save our colony. Listen, I don't care a single whit what you do, so long as you leave me out of it. Which means, get off my board damn channel! I'm more than finished with you lot. Okay. Really? Are we doing this? The thing is, right? Retrieve the gunship's targeting module. Can do. But it's making me choose again who to put on top here. And I don't care about either of them. At all. I feel like MSI's just like a bungling 
want to be caught. Well, they want to get back on the board. And they're just kind of like, ooh, sniveling bureaucrats. But the iconoclasts, particularly Graham, are just so tedious. They're so tedious. I mean, I guess if I go for the iconoclast, then I can roll in that please find my son Tucker quest. Oh, look, there we are. All that time and character creation well spent. Um, oh, for fuck. I mean, I'll go get it, but I don't really want to give it to either of them. I wonder if I can sell it <laughs> to a third party. Maybe Phineas will want it. Oh, this is a bad way to go out, isn't it? Eh, uh, no, we'll be all right. Oh dear, ow. We'll mostly be all right. Just, it's just a light break in the ankle. Is that even the right way to go? Let's check the map. Once I pick up these energy cells. Uh, it's over there. Oh. Well, Devil's Peak Caverns. I can... It's the closest way to get over that bridge, isn't it? Ah, I just... Mm. It is fun. It is fun when it's like, can you choose the fate of the settlement, please, and decide who comes out on top? Like, that is an interesting thing. Like, everyone remembers the first time they dealt with Megaton in Fallout 3. But not every bloody settlement. You know? Skyrim belongs to the Nords. No one cares. Here they come. Oops. There we go. Oh, that's not dead. Look at us. Yeah, that went well. What's over there? That's a Manta Queen. Let's make sure I'm going the right way. Yes, I just have to follow this road. Let's try and sneak. Need to make this much longer than it needs to be. That's a Marauder, so we will kill him at least. Toot! Jeez. Kill him and some. Hello! God, this assault rifle's good. Absolutely preposterous gun. Break down the vermin. Break that down. Right, go on, let's get a wriggle on. We'll get this thing. I guess if I don't really care about either faction, it doesn't really matter which one I do it for. Let's just hoon it. Leave that scrap mechanical to its own business. Come on, Yoka! Ah! Shit the bed. That was effective. Oopsie. Oh, it turns out I just reloaded. Oh god, I shot Pavati! Oh, I shouldn't have shot Pavati! This is a bit much! Fuck off, Mantis Swarm. Why am I on fire? I'm really low on ammo. For some things. Oh, <laughs> not for the, uh... Not for the euthanasia kit, at least. Okay, alright. What ammo do I need? Probably heavy, right? Anyway, right. Come on. We're, we're just gonna hoon it. Let me go get that thing. Uh-oh! Okay, 
maybe I shouldn't have gone in with the euthanasia kit. <sighs> this is what happens when you rush too much, Johnny. Come on. That's it. Go back to being on fire. Just gently on fire. Good. There we go. Right. Uh-oh. Scrap mechanical's woken up. Run! Run away! Safely run away, away! Oops. Yeah, sure. Meh. That's more like it. Oh, hello, you're over there as well. Nyoka? Oh dear. Oops, missed. Level up. Da -da 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 ding. What else do we want to improve? Sure, let's just do that. Accept. Right. No dilly dallying. Ah, oh, more of them. Well, I suppose this is a settlement. I should have expected them to be here, really. Scrap mechanical. Going silent. I need those two to heal up, really. Uh oh. Got it. Sure. No, no, no! Don't move up. Oh God! I told them to move up. I was dicking with the radial to try and tell them to stay close. Oh well. Oh, hey, mechanical. Got you, fucking bastard. Right. Robophobia, eh? So, let's see. Auto mechanicals now give you the willies. And when they're nearby, you're not as effective as you should be. Dex what, minus one, perception minus one, temperament minus one. Reward one perk point. Sure, I'll take it. Why not? Okay, let's do it. Let's see now. Vendor buying price. What I'd really like is... Is there something that's just like, you find more ammo? I suppose there's this. Additional ammo available. Yeah, yeah. Mm, bonus to extra headshot or weak spot damage doesn't sound awful. I do like trying for headshots. Yeah, sure. And we've unlocked a whole new range of perks. Oops. Oops, a daisy. I didn't actually equip it though, did I? No, not that. It's uh, which one was it? There we go. Apply. Accept. Okie dokie. Onwards. Do 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 do. Cascadia. Well, we need to go to Cascadia in order to cross the river. So, hmm, but it looks very locked. I don't have the locking ability, uh, lockpick ability for that. Oops, a daisy. Well, hmm, this is. Oh, for fuck, there's another way to get over. Oh, and I can even tear one publications. But is it a. Is it going to be a pain in the ass to get round there? I don't think it is even. Look, you can just. Fine. Well, that's. Another day of absolutely stellar navigation, Johnny. Well d Ow! Well done. Really outdid yourself. Are we far enough to fast travel now? Yes, we are. Here we go. Okie dokie. Oh, God. Oh, no. 
The Iconoclast and MSI are fighting each other. That's bad. Gonna sell your ship for beer money? What a horrible way to talk to someone as they're dying. Your ship for beer money, rather. Wow, okay, well. That, that happened. That happened. Ooh, let's try and sneak past the Manta Queen. If we can manage it. I really like these mushrooms. You actually do get mushrooms in real life that spread out a, um, like a, a, a almost like a, a skirt of fibers with holes like that. The tops of these mushrooms look like morels, which are delicious. I fucking hate mantis swarms, though, I have to say. Incoming! All right, we're going loud, are we? Do them in. <laughs> that looked like such overkill. Oh, reload, Johnny. You dingus. Oh, Nyoka's down. Again. Ah! I like the way their heads pop up. Oh, oh, they're kind of cute. Not so cute. I won't kill them, obviously, but they are kind of cute. Sorry, everybody. I know you keep getting downed. Oh boy. All right. Well, there's the ship at least. Oh wow, this reminds me of one of the areas on Destiny 2, with the weird AI ship. Oh, heck. Raptor on Colossus. Oh, a Raptor on Colossus that is getting hurt? No. The sulfur pits don't seem that safe or good for a person. Ah, oh, tits. Please die. Oh good, it died. Whoa, that sounded very bad. Oh, it's a testament to Ashley Birch's acting ability. The, the, the noises Pavati makes when she takes damage are horrible. I feel bad for being such a crap leader in combat. Zoom in! I felt better! I have felt better! Oh, Jesus. Well, that sort of worked. Oh, God. What is this? You know what? Shop for new items later, Johnny. When you're not being attacked by deadly creatures. How about that? Fuck, fuck, fuck. Ah, oh, Christ! Whew. Ammo! Don't mind if I do. Dead people, sorry that you died. 
What is this gun? Heavy machine gun? Delightful. Oh, thank God, I've got ammo in my nice, good assault rifle again. Bloody hell. I'm going to try and sneak past while those two auto-heal. It's just nice to have companions that aren't, you know, at death's door all the time. Especially when I feel like it's my fault if they are down. Okie dokie. Right. Hello. You go on ahead, Captain. I'm not keen on ships, even when they're in the best of shape. Okay. Yep. We'll be keeping watch here. Okay. Sure. Requires gunship captain's key to unlock. Well, where's the gunship captain? Captain wants his captain's key is active, but his life signs are no longer detected on the bridge. Logging flight hours while not present for duty is a violation of EDL policy. Eject Captain Matsu's command key. Locate targeting module. Primary routing. Access requires the key. Well, let's eject the key. I've got it. Right, that's that was easy. Sorry you died. <gasps> Assault Rifle Ultra. Assault Rifle Ultra. Uh, uh, six two nine DPS. Well, that's even why that's even better than this one. Okay, although it's got a smaller, it's got a smaller mag size, but you know what? It, the damage is absolutely bananas, so. Right, up we, up we pop. Hello, cantankerous canid targeting module. Optional, give it to Sanjar or Graham. Uh, Graham doesn't know what he's doing. Sanjar also isn't great. Hi, you two. Who are we going to give it to? Who are we going to give it to? I'm kind of more inclined to, to Graham because it means that the board, MSI, are going to have a harder time getting on the board. We don't like the board. We don't want to. We don't want to deal with the board's allies. Let's just give it to Graham. That'll be fine. Ugh. Oh, Graham! I guess I'll put this gun away. Now, also, journal. Where is this was silly boy? Small, not small. A family matter. Tucker, Tucker. Why, Tucker? Hello. Ooh, vending machine. I would like heavy ammo, please. Tucker. You got any little sprat? Tucker. Tucker! Looks like I'm not the only new face around here. Jesus! What do I call you, stranger? I thought Tucker was going to be like 14. That's a 45-year-old man. Stranger suits me just fine. Oh, come on. We like to be friendly around here. At the least, let me call you captain. Whether or not you command a ship, if you've found your way here, you must be a leader type. Kiss ass. So then, captain, welcome to Amber Heights. Oh, and uh, call me Tucker. 
You here to join the Iconoclasts? Help us free this world? No. Tucker, you're Agnes's little boy from Stella Bay? I am not a little boy. Haven't been one for decades, no matter what my mama wishes. I take it she's still looking for me? I'd hope she'd accept my decision. She made it seem like you were in danger. Asked me to rescue you. According to her, stepping foot outside of the house in broad daylight is too dangerous. My entire life she crammed a fear of danger down my throat. Danger? Don't go play with friends. Mantasaurs will tear your arms off. Don't leave the city. Raptodons will spit acid on your face. Marauders can violate you. You'd fall in a sulfur pool. I stuck around way too long, ruled by her fears. <laughs> I'm 42 years old, but He's she still 40s. sees me as a little boy in need of her protection. I won't stand for it, I tell you. Yeah, yeah, you've got mommy issues, we get it. Running away is for cowards, you need to face her and show her you've grown up. Yeah, let's do, let's do the persuade. Running away is for cowards, you need to face her and show her you've grown up. She doesn't want to see me as anything other than her baby boy. Why would I go back again? What'll be different this time? Mm -hmm. You survived outside of Stella Bay for weeks. Show her the skills you've learned, or teach her the iconoclast philosophies. Convert her so that she might join you in freedom. Show her the skills you've learned. <sighs> You're right. I can do this. I just need to stand my ground and make her see she can't control me anymore. No one can. Yeah. All right, Tucker. Okay, we can return to her if we want to. Oh yeah, I forgot that there was a murder. Uh, Phineas. Uh, no, 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 no. Where's the uh, Cyprus? I found out of the secret people. Oh yeah. Um, faction quest. That's the one. Where's Graham? Graham! Graham! Not Sanjar. Graham. I think Graham is a grade A tool, and I think his second in command would be much better to lead the Iconoclast. But, you know, if it means we can dick over the board in a roundabout way, I'm for it. Graham! The gunship. Have you secured its targeting module? Nice to see you too, Graham. Yes. Yes, I have. At last. Now we must secure the Stellar Bay landing pad. We will fortify the city against the board's assault. I can't see how killing a bunch of folks minding their own business is going to save Monarch. Mm. It doesn't seem right. And you, Captain? Are you prepared? I'm not sure about this anymore. I don't suppose you could work with Sanja rather than against him. No. Our hearts have long since closed to one another. Me. He is blinded by his love for bureaucracy. I'm not ready to hand it over just Time yet. is of the essence, Captain. Be swift with your decision. Oh, he's such a tool, though. I don't want either of them to have it, so I don't have to give them it. But then it just won't advance the quest. It won't provide a res resolution, will it? Uh, we could go talk to Sanjar and see what he has to say, or we could just give it to Graham, but... Pavati's right, like, killing a bunch of randoms isn't really gonna help much, is it? Ugh. Let's go see Sanjar. I wanna know what he's gonna do about it. Where is Sanjar again? Sanjar is in Stella Bay. Manta pillars are so gross, but also so cute. Look at them. Okie dokie, Sanjar. Also, where's Thingy? Where's my reward? Lady. Is that Tucker? Oh, oh Captain, yeah. you did it! My little little boy is back safe and sound. Tell the captain how grateful we are, Tuck Tuck. 
Mama, I told you that I'm not staying. I just came back to talk to you about why I left. Then I'm going back to Amber Heights. Oh, we'll get that silliness sorted out. You're safe here with me, and that's how it's going to stay. Isn't that right? Oh, no, he's awful. Your son is a grown man. It's time you started treating him like one. What a sour thing to say. My little boy will always need me. I'm his mama, you know. He's 42. Mama, what I need is for you to listen to what I want for once. But that's between us. Now you promised the captain a reward, so settle up. Mm -hmm. Then you and me are gonna have a long talk. Here, kind stranger. This is every bit I've scrimped and scraped for years to save. But it's more than worth it to have my Tuk Tuk home safe again. Good luck, both of you. Fucking hell. All right, Sanja. Convince me. If the Iconoclasts reach that ship first, there won't be any chance for a peaceful monarch. I don't suppose you've found the targeting module yet. I've sent patrols, but they're running into trouble with the Iconoclasts. Could you agree to a truce with the Iconoclasts? Oh, no, why do you need the targeting module? Well, because the module controls the weapons systems. Yes. I mean, why do you need the gunship's weapon systems? Because once we mount them on Stellar Bay's walls, no Marauder or Raptodon will ever be a threat to us again. Stellar Bay will be as secure as any other settlement in Halcyon. I don't see how a UDL is going to let you keep their toys. The board's own salvage and recovery clause 32B would say differently. Oh! And they won't dare challenge us over this. Not after the data you found on their experiments here. Enough about the gunship. Good, because we haven't a moment to lose. Tet, 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 tet. Could you agree to a truce with the Iconoclasts? They're all mad. And what's more, they left us. Ugh. I don't see any way for us to work together. I've read your review, Sanja. You can't do this alone. Uh, not this again. Yes, this again. Remember what we practiced, sir. Mm -hmm. Yes. The words in those reviews were very hurtful, but they do not define me. I am a manta pillar, and my will is my cocoon. I can emerge and become whatever I wish. God. You're good with details, but you could use someone who sees the big picture. The people who write your reviews are the same type of people you'll deal with on the board. Or pull your head out of your ass, Sanjar. Don't screw this opportunity up over your wounded pride. People who wrote your reviews, the same type of people you'll deal with on the board, I think is what I'm going to say. I hadn't thought of it that way. Uh huh. Perhaps you have a point. Supposing you're right, who exactly would you have me work with? The Iconoclasts are not the most compromising sort. Not Graham. What about Graham's second in command, Zora? That's an interesting suggestion. I confess I don't know much about her except that she worked for Rizzo. Here we go. There ain't a body on this planet that can keep a group patched up like she has. I don't know how she does it. I'd be willing to consider it, but I need to see her review first. Ugh. Are you serious? One can't be haphazard about these things. Sanja. Besides, if you think her skills will complement mine, then we should see what those skills are. Okay. Fine. Excellent. Her review would be in the Rizzo offices in Cascadia. Bring it to me, and I'll see if she's qualified. I'll let you know when I've made progress. I want to do this. I want to. I want to find that third option. I want them to work together. I want Zora to become more important than Graham because Graham is a tool. Right, where's that HR terminal? Where does that live? Oh, it's just over there. Aha! But can I get in there? Well, let's try it. At least we've got that fast travel to Cascadia Turnpike this time. It's 
nice and quiet here as well. HR terminal. How do we get in? Damn it. Is this thing going to try and kill me? Oh, shit! A mine! Oops, I hit the wrong one. Hey, hey! Oh, maybe I just need to kill the marauders. Bong! Rate of fire is lower on this rifle. Ooh, a wreck. Oh, it looks like we could have just gone round the side earlier. That's quite funny. Nyoka, you're down again. Okay, everyone's down again. I do feel bad. Alright. Oh, hello. I didn't see you up there. Please die. Thank you. Everybody get up again. Who's left? Ah! Rude! Thank you! That was really rude. Oh yeah, sorry you got knocked again. It's a lovely refrain, that. So it's quite John Williams-esque. Hello! Ah! Oh, I really should stop catching fire. Oh, Pavati's down. I'm just trying to get to a bloody computer. Yeah, we're alive. They'll never see us. Ooh, vending machine, is it? Oh, it's a fun helmet. Let's get this review. View data. Executive review Zora. Zora is a top notch sawbones with a good head for working under pressure. She knows how to assimilate large amounts of detailed information to make quick decisions. Her competence and decisiveness have allowed her to restore more than a few limbs and digits lost to carelessness around the machinery. Recommend for employee of the month. Absolutely phenomenal. Right. Great. Export executive review for Blackwood Dora to external data pad. Please remove your data pad from the transfer socket. Transfer socket is what I call my redacted. Right. Let's go convince thing of me. Oh, near hostiles, aren't I? Let's go convince Sanjar. Zora is the one for the job. <laughs> it's amazing how much you can fit in a leg. Look, a bit cartridge, light ammo, adreno, and an entire gun. All in one leg. The human body really is an incredible thing. Alrighty. Oh, Sanja. Hmm. 
Hello, mate. Any luck bringing the iconoclast to the bargaining table? Oh. I don't like the idea that they'll be trying for that module while we delay. I've got the module, dingus. I found Zora's review here. Very well. I can't promise anything, but let's see what we have here. It's a great review. Well, it seems like she, uh, she's actually very qualified. Mm -hmm. If it weren't for her, I'd wager the iconoclast would have died off a while ago. Agreed. I wasn't expecting to say this, but if you can put her in charge and convince her to agree to a meeting, I'd be willing to discuss terms. <laughs> I'm going to go kill Graham. Hopefully. Boing. Let's go murder Graham. Let's go murder Graham. Let's go murder Graham. And get ourselves a corpse. Specifically, Graham's corpse. Oh, Zora! Ooh, weapons bench. Hello! Right. Now let's see about this Assault Rifle Ultra. I would like to modify you, please, by giving you a bigger mag. Lovely. Lovely, lovely, lovely. Uh, do we need anything here? Not really. Oh, I'll give you a gyro site. Why not? How about a fun barrel? Whisper quiet. Or fun to increase his crit damage. Reduces the noise of each shot. Let's do that. Stealthy little assault rifle now, aren't ya? Oh, and then repair. Repair all equipped. Lovely. How about armor? Uh, we seem to be all right. Okie dokie. Right. Hello, Zora. How would you feel about doing little a coup as a treat? Hey, Captain. I need your help. Oh. We ought to keep it hush-hush. Seems like you're very up for you it. You know about what happened here, right? The history of Amber Heights? I don't, actually. Fella came through Edgewater once, mentioned something to my dad about pirates wiping out of town. You mean this is the same place? Right. Common belief is that the pirates fled to an old relay station that had already been abandoned, but nobody could find them. The station's locked up, but one of my people found an old data cartridge in a nearby wrapped nest. It's mostly corrupted, but I pulled a couple codes off of it. One is the code to the Amber Heights gate. I don't recognize the other, but it's similar. I bet it opens a door. Mm -hmm. I don't get what's so important about this. Don't you have bigger problems? I surely do, but it's not far. And if they died in there, they died with their munitions. We'll need them. Besides, if it's filled with valuables from the aristocrats who lived here, we can pawn them off on sublight and get ourselves ahead on our food budget. Mm-hmm. Okay. I'm just looking up the voice actor for um, for Zora Blackwood. Uh, and it's uh, Sumali Montano. Oh, she's... Okay. I recognize her voice. She's the female Inquisitor in Dragon Age Inquisition. Uh, Yuna in Ghost of Tsushima. She's been on Critical Role. I haven't played any of these. But she, yeah, she's got a familiar voice. She sounds like somebody who's in Destiny 2, actually. Wait! Okay, so she's... Alright, so she's in XCOM 2. Destiny 2! She's Soraya Hawthorne! Knew I knew her voice! Hmm. Well, well, well. Anyway, right. Uh, the Amber Heights gate. Okay, go to the re relay station and see if the code's useful. Anything else? Just a warning. Ugh. The area is infested with mantisaurs. I'd send some help, but we're, you know, preparing for war. Well, I need to talk to you, actually. 
I'll consider it, but no promises. Sure. I'll be here if you change your mind. Right, but I need to talk to you about something. Hey, Captain. Any thoughts on that errand we talked about? No, shh, listen. Yeah, I'll help. I appreciate Ugh. it. Here's the code. If it works, bring back anything you find. Supplies are best, but information's good too. This quest is called Sucker Bait. Someone was behind the Amber Heights massacre? It give a lot of people around here some closure to find out who and string them up. Mm -hmm. Good luck. Watch out for the Taros. Well, I bet you she's going to be like, no, Graham's in charge, and it turns out it was Graham who did the thing. Welcome back. You find Not yet. I have to do this in order to talk to her? This sucks. I... What? Do I have to do this? Sucker bait. Sure. Okay. Okay, but I, I I really really want Zora to welcome back. Okay, well it looks like we have to do this uh, this side mission. That's fine. It'll hopefully be quick, and hopefully it'll lead to Zora putting a bullet in Graham's head. So we're we're gonna do it. But I was kind of really excited to talk to her about working with Sanjar and building a better community together without loads of uh, you know bloodshed. But here we are. Right, active quest sucker bait. Fast travel over there. Sometimes this game is a bit breathless with the quests it's giving you, and it kind of like, it feels like some of the moments that you could be having, like advancing a quest, are kind of subsumed by the fact that it's like, and here's another thing I found out. Oh, you'll want to do this. This is intriguing. All right, Stealthy does it. Do, 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 do. Get her gun out. Abandoned relay station discovered. Oh shit. Please go away. Oh, damn it. Fuck my life! Oh, that scared the shit out of me. Oh, that really scared me. Oh my god. Show me yourself to tummy. That's right, you die. Don't take that caterpie, you little prick. Oh, it's not dead. Okay? Now it's dead. Shit, oh my god, that really made me jump. Use terminal, enter code. Alright. Unauthorized entry into the records room would result in immediate reassignment. What? Whoa. Well, let's search the area. Yep, those are corpses, alright. Ammo, light ammo, energy cells, dead body, hemlock's eye patch. Sure, I'll take that. Pick weapon parts, some bits, Mr. Power. Some bits. Lots of bits. Okay. In fairness, it was worth coming here. Old data cartridge. Don't really need it. Oh, but Zora would be interested to see it. Understood. feel like they did leave any weapons here, but let's see what's on the terminal, shall we? Substation has been decommissioned. Communications functionality has been disabled. Longs and messages have been archived. Work order. Tunnels are in. Cables are laid. Devil's Peak is receiving, but we're waiting on signal confirmation from the outposts. Heard something in the caverns underneath. 
We've got signal for Amber Heights, Stella Bay, and Cascadia. Yeah, the caverns ain't safe. Closure of work order. Lead engineer Franklin uh, Valkovitz has perished due to a workplace accident involving hostile wildlife in the Devil's Peak Caverns. Uh, public notice on the issuing of a hazard clause for Terra 1. It's been denounced as a feasible workplace environment. Okay. Manual log entry. Aha! Gonna die for this damn fool errand, I know it. He said Amber Heights was gonna have more bits than we can spend, but those suited morons up and spent it all for us. Books and vases and pretty shit. He can't eat a fucking book. Look at us now. One of the closets to coop up in... Uh, of all the closets to keep up in and look at was wounds. We had to choose the one that's set to lock itself up. Feel like a marauder digging at the walls like this, but we've got to get out before we starve. It ain't possible, but Nelson over there is trying to keep our spirits up, and I don't got the energy to fight him on it. Screw that Bryant fella. Eyes bigger than his fucking stomach. Hmm, we've got some names. Let's go back to Amber Heights. At least that was pretty quick. I thought that was going to be like a whole big facility to, to tramp around in. Nope, not that way. This way. Azura! Boing. Welcome back. I found a box of old data cartridges. Let's see. These are old. Looks like correspondences between the pirates. Mm -hmm. Some bits here, some there. Some... Wait. This... This one's got the Amber Heights gate code on it. Just like the one I found earlier. And here's... A letter. Wait, this is from Graham. Yes! Oh, of all the... Let's kill him. Captain. He gave them the gate code. Let's kill him. He caused the attack. Yeah. He did. Let's kill him. They really did. Let's go kill him. I know he's got his head in the clouds, but I always believed there was a core of good there. What the hell happened to live and let live? Look, I need to think. Plan. Figure out if I should talk to him or shoot him. Or both. Just don't give him the module yet. Give me a little time. I'll meet you at his place. Let's kill him! Oh, <laughs> Oh, I'm glad I got involved in this after all. Oh, lovely. Oh, we can pickpocket. I didn't didn't realize. Still from humans while sneaking. Lovely. Lockpick preview. See what's inside lock containers. Let's put our lockpick all the way up. Yes! Great. Okay. New perks, eh? Armor oh, Master. Wild Science. Your next attack after killing an enemy is a guaranteed critical hit. I like the sound of that. Let's get that. Yeah. Lovely. Right. We should really get some better armor on our pals here. Val uh, sorry. Uh, Nyoka's in, got 19. Let's give her some elite troop armor. Why not? There we go. Should we give her a helmet? I don't want her to wear a helmet because I like looking at them. Where's that other really good assault rifle? Pavati, you can have that. For armor. I guess that's pretty good. Should we give her an eye patch? <laughs> she <l> <laughs> Uh, she looks like a solid snake. <laughs> yeah, we're doing that. Lovely. Come here, Favati. Where are you? 
Yeah! <laughs> Hell yeah! Oh, I love it. Absolutely phenomenal. Very, very strong. Okay, right. Let's go. Not Phineas. Wait, where, how do we... Journal. Radio Free Monarch. No, we don't want that. We want Kenny's... Cradle. No, where's the... We need to go see Graham. So we can kill him. But. Sanjar's over there. Zora's there. Where's Graham? Go take a walk, Captain. I'll find you once my head's on straight. Okie dokie. Sleepy iconoclasts over there. found Nyoka, isn't it? Aha! Graham! Let's go confront him with lethal force. The gunship. Have you secured its targeting module? I know you're responsible for the Amber Heights massacre. When I founded the Iconoclasts, I did so amidst the ghosts of this planet's past. Since then, many have asked me, why here? Were you involved in the massacre? Was that some gruesome plot to clear a path for my dreams? Mm -hmm. My response to you is the same as to all others. The death of MSI was an incidental tragedy. I'd have walked this path with or without it. You're avoiding the issue. You set pirates on, on innocent lives. I did no such thing. Their deaths came in the night while I slept in Stellar Bay. And regardless, we're discussing a past long since left behind. Those ghosts still haunt me. But they needn't curse my people. When the entire colony has embraced our truth, perhaps then the perpetrator will come into the light. Until then, it does us no good to dwell on past mistakes. Gonna kill ya. For the sake of argument, why do you imagine the perpetrator might have done it? If I were the type of man to make that decision, and I assure you I am not, mm -hmm. I'd have to be so obsessed with dismantling their regime that I'd turn to desperate measures. I have since learned that their mistakes will end them in time and that we will persevere where they do not. But back then, suffocating under that oppressive culture, I can understand a lesser man than myself making a terrible, ghastly mistake. Calling a massacre a ghastly mistake is putting it a bit mildly. Would you prefer I spend my days wallowing in misery and desperately seeking forgiveness for sins long past? I have people to lead, a home to keep. You're gonna die. Here, without the shackles of the Halcyon board, we are free to grow as the universe intended. Had we fled with MSI, our spirits would have withered. You've seen that withering yourself. The colony is dying. The massacre of Amber Heights, unfortunate as it was, presented the slim possibility <laughs> of saving the souls of Terra too. Unfortunate. Here we are, poised to do just that. You can't play judge, jury, and execution like that. I have a feeling the rest of your people won't agree. Or Halcyon does need more people willing to take matters into their own hands. I have a feeling the rest of your people won't agree. If that's the case, they are free to say so. And I will take their opinions into consideration after we've accomplished our goals. 
For now, our sights must remain on spreading our message. Let us speak no more of this. The gunship. Have you secured its targeting module? Fuck off. Not yet. Oh, hey, Nioka. I thought you were, for a second, I thought you were, um. Uh, uh, ba -ba -ba Zora. How do we prompt her to go do something? Do something, Zora! Take a walk, Captain. Blah, 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 blah. Go take a walk. Ah! Okay, so. Go take a walk, Captain. I'll find you once my head's on straight. I don't see how to get her to. There's no more dialogue options with her. Graham's just going to keep demanding the thing. Sanja is waiting for Zora to come to the negotiating table. Did we just go kill Graham? I think we maybe just go kill Graham. Because number one, that would be fun. And number two, I don't see another way to... Yeah, let's just... There we go, there we go! Great. I mean, he deserved that, so... Right. Was that the right thing to do? Iconoclasts are now understanding. Well, that's good. <laughs> I'm glad they understand what I just did. Right, now let's go talk to Zora. Zora! Hi! Guess I'm in charge now. Yes! Still trying to figure out what that means. Mm, mm, mm. You got the... Void held me. I'll never remember what that thing is called. The device from the ship. Mm -hmm. Do you have it? I do. Hold on. I was thinking you and Sanjar could join forces. Absolutely not. With Graham gone, the Iconoclasts are on edge as it is. I don't need a riot on my hands. Mm. Wait, what? Really? Not yet, I'll be back. I thought... I, but please? Hey. Hey! You got the... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Absol... Shit. Is my persuade not high enough or something? What's the... Not yet, I'll be back. Character. Wait, my... Skills. Uh, dialogue, persuade, 48. But no, it's up to 61, thanks to those. Thanks to Pavati. Surely that's got to be high enough. Or do I need my base one to be higher? Do I have anything in my inventory that can pump up my... Temporarily pump up my persuade? Like, lager. <laughs> Hmm. But I don't want... Uh, I don't want to... Basically, I don't want to wipe out the Iconoclast or Sanjar and his lot. I want them to work together. But she doesn't seem interested. Which is bad. There's got to be a way around this. Alright, I'm not proud of it, but I googled it. Uh, and I need a persuade of 55. My persuade is 48. But it's up to 61 with Pavati in the thing. I think it might have to be base. So, oh, do I have to level up? I just leveled up so recently. Character. Skills. There's nowhere to respec, is there? God damn it. Do I have anything that will make me more persuasive? from wearing it. <gasps> Persuade plus five! Okay, that's good. Okay, that's a start. Character... 
This way 48 is up to 66, but that's still just the... Come on, Zora. Zora, come on, hey. hey. You got the... Yeah, 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 I know, I know. Join uh, forces! Uh, I don't want to give her the targeting module. Ah! Oh, God, no, don't, don't threaten to shoot anyone, though. How much XP do I have? This is silly. I should maybe just finish this side quest. You know what? Maybe let's go talk to Phineas and talk next steps and come back here once we've leveled up. Because if we can put our Persuade up as a base skill... Oh, that's so frustrating! I want to solve this amicably. Because this is the first time I found the third option on a thing. You know? Right, and then we want to go to Stella Bay Ruins south. <sighs> Zora, please. I shot a man in the head for you. Granted, I've shot lots of people in the head before, but that one was specifically for you, young lady. <laughs> Just gotta level up once, that's all. That's all we gotta do. I wonder sometimes what they're doing on other colonies. Uh -huh. Hey, what's up, Grim? Ah. Oh. Boing. Boing. Okay, right. We go talk to Phineas. Hopefully he'll be like, here's so much XP you've leveled up. And then we can go back down. Some crew members are causing a disturbance on the ship. What? Felix, what are you doing? You're adjusting before you pull. You're <gasps> anticipating it. You... Of course I'm anticipating it. What if I shoot a friend on accident? That's on account of your stance. You want to lean into it. Embrace it. Work with it. You're in control here, Parvati, not the gun. Don't let a hunk of metal jerk you around. You've been around powerful machinery all your life. And you're always in control, right? I guess that's kind of like when the filler's shooting 600 cans of near molten sal tuna down the conveyor while I'm trying to tune a belt. Here, stand like me. Just so. Hip square. Lean forward a little. It's just equipment, and you're just an engineer using it. Okay. We'll try again later. You'll get it. I promise. That was sweet. I like those two. Really glad we got Nyoka on, on the ship. Right, let's go see Phineas. Oh, I'm an old oh, Zora, you troublesome, you Either stubborn. Hooray! Let's go see Phineas. Sorry, Felix. You're just not as interesting as the other two. Phineas! <clears throat> ah. Hello? Can you hear me? Yes. Does this work? Yes. Oh, damn it! I'm just securing my ongoing experiments. And securing myself. He sounds like, um... Mr. Fish Odor from, uh, Bob's Burgers. Mind the mess, sir. I haven't had a visitor since, uh... In fact, I've never had a visitor. Built your children. Hee hee! Bubbles! And. Oh, a dead one. Oh, I'm sorry, Sisty Pig. Hello, Bubbles! Bloody love a pig, I do. Right. What are you? Shrink Ray? Let's not fuck around with that. You. I'd clap you on the shoulder if I weren't behind a wall of bulletproof glass. I don't know how you did it. But Hiram Blythe just sent me everything I needed. Well, you know. According to Hiram's message, Minister Clark has ordered a suspicious typical Oops. elitist hoarding supplies during a time. He just said a suspicious quantity of something. 
Uh, if I didn't know any better, he he's hoarding the whole colony supply. Sorry, I accidentally hit the space bar. Of scarcity. Once I have those chemicals, we can revive the Hope's colonists and put some decent people in charge. Mm -hmm. So, good news. You're going to Byzantium and stealing those chemicals. Exciting. What was that about Minister Clark? Aloysius Clark, Minister of Earth. Virtually every colony requires the presence of a Minister of Earth. Mm -hmm. Clark is complicit in every one of the board's crimes. Whenever the board issues some new decree, you'll find Clark's signature on the dotted line. Well, well. Just tell me what to do. Ah, yes, the details. I'm not about to ask you to rampage through Byzantium trading bullets with the board's agents. We'll have to resort to subterfuge. Carmen Imagawa. She's my contact in Byzantium. Meet her at the docks. She'll have all the necessary intelligence you require. I'm giving you my old nav key to Byzantium. You'll need it to land in the Golden City. Thank you. Remember, you're looking for dimethyl sulfoxide. Big green bubbling vessel with a warning label. I'll take as much as you can find. Great. Anything I should know about this Kam Carmen Imagawa? Trust her if that's what you're asking. Imagawa is the finest special agent in Byzantium that money can buy. My money, anyway. Mm. All right. Find Carmen Imagawa. Steal chemicals. Got it. Leave conversation. That was a good chunk of XP. Not enough, but a good chunk. Aha! I see you found my portable molecular compression device, better known as a shrink ray. Find a target, point, shoot. Your target will shrink down into a manageable size, whereupon you may commence beating them to a pulp. That sounds great. Feel free to try it on a marauder sometime. Or on a sisty pig? I'm not going to do that. I don't want to do that to bubbles. Okay. Oh, there are so many dead sisty pigs. Ooh, we can hack into Phineas's thing? Let's do it. <laughs> Two, H. Blythe. Dumped a new associate, dirt side. They have a stake in my purpose, but trust in them only about 23.7% at present. They're recovering a ship, should be along any time. Just need to know where to send them. Let me know when you get this. Eager to be done. Interesting. Careful, that's my communications terminal. Yes. Yes, it is. I just hacked it. How do you like me now? Hmm. Hmm. Right, well. I think that'll probably do it for this week. I'm honestly tempted to just go planet side and just run around shooting so many things that I level up. And then we can go persuade, hopefully, persuade Zora to work with Sanja. I don't know why. When I for arrest, space adventuring is tiring work. Mm -hmm. I don't know why when this started, I was like, I don't know why when my reaction to this all starting was like, oh, I don't care about either of these factions. I now really want to see it done, but I really want to see it done. It's just, it's in, it's in my, it's, it's under my skin now. We could go to the Cascadia landing pad and shoot lots of things. Let's do it. Maybe I'll do that off screen on maybe I'll maybe before the next episode. Here, yes, yes, yes. Maybe for the next episode I'll shoot loads of things and try and level up. Let's try it. Warning dangerous. Continue. Oh just annoyed. Right. Certainly seems like there's enemies. Jesus. Incoming. What fuck? Oh, it's just a sprat. But it gave us some, uh... Ooh, that was good. It gave us a chunk of XP, so I'll take it. Yeah, let's just kill our way to a peaceful resolution. Here we go. I'll you right up. 
Womp. Pavati looks so cool. Oops. Oh, it's not dead. This is how we fix the war. By declaring war on local animals. God, this is actually going really... Ooh, shit. Yeah, we can do this. Come on. Suck it, Manta Queen. And also drone. Go on. Screw him up, Nuka. To shreds, you say? You're to shreds, I say. Take that, Manta Queen. Yes, yes. Give me the XP. Ah, uh, please don't set me on fire. I do hate it so. It's so inconvenient to be a flame, you know? Who's next? Where are you? You up there? You in the building? I'll find you. When I find you, I'm gonna point a gun at you. You can get the best wine on mine. What do I see in this place? Ah, Mantis Wolves. Oh, the Mantapilla bar. Sorry, Mantapillas. And one wrapped it on, seemingly. Who's next? Come on. Ooh, let's pick this. Because picking is also experience. <gasps> Grenade launcher, too. Yes, please. Bard. Come on, I need more things to shoot. Aha! Request acknowledged, seemingly. Where's the door to this one? How do I get in? This is what happens when I get two into a side quest. Rizzo's. Paw, paw, paw. We're really getting there. Oh, we're in a bottle production thing of me, probably. Okay. Right, more things to shoot. Please. Rats, I'll take him. Oh, it's so close. Right, where else can we kill things? Cascadia? Cascade oh, Cascadia itself? Yeah, I don't hate it. Yeah, let's go Cascadia. Hopefully there's more things to kill. Come on, we can do this. So much for wrapping up the episode, hey. Yes, enemies. Hello? Hello? No, they're in the building. You'd think I'd learn. Come on. Wow, that was some of the worst shooting I've ever done. Give me things to hack. Give me things to shoot. Oh, you look hackable. There we go. Hello? Anyone else to shoot? 
Oh wait, that's not loud. Hello! Unsuspecting marauders! Aha! You'll do! Oopsie. Oh, good serpentining though. Oh, we're so nearly there. Uh, come on, come on, something to hack, something to hack. Or lockpick. Ah, uh, like one more marauder will do it. That looks disgusting. Uh, right. Oopsie daisy. Just need one more thing to shoot. Is there anyone upstairs? Nothing upstairs. Functionally, there is no upstairs. Right, let's go, Cascadia. There's got to be something in the wilderness we can shoot, right? Oh no, we're in Cascadia. Silly Johnny. Cascadia Turnpike. Let's go there. Hello! Incoming! Yes! Da -da 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 right? Why didn't it make the noise? The thing in the corners ticked out. Ooh! Gimme! Gimme, gimme, gimme! Persuade! My persuade's only 50. Have I got to do it again? Yes. Well, that's anticlimactic. Right. Before the next episode. I'm going to level up one more time. I'm going to I'm going to run around in this game and I'm going to find enough things to shoot to put me one level up so my persuade goes high enough enough that we can convince Zora to work with Sanjar. Then we can put this right properly having done the third uh, option rather than picking one of the two. This is my solemn vow. I'm going to do this side quest right. So anyway, um thank you for this episode of uh, watching this episode of Preston Kid and you rather. Um Safe to say, I got a little bit overly, overly um, committed there, but that's, you know, sometimes it's nice to do that in a video game, to find yourself just really wanting to do that one thing just because you want it badly enough. Um, so, yeah, uh, that'll do it for this week. As uh, as ever, there's loads of stuff for you to watch on the channel, uh, including past Let's Play series and live streams and, and all that good stuff. I do have a Patreon. There's a link in the description of this video. It's patreon.com forward slash Johnny Chiodini. If you are able to support me directly uh, through Patreon um, and, and you would like to do so, then uh, that would be very much appreciated. But uh, truly, just thank you for watching and for being here and for putting up with me just yelling about finding enough marauders Shoot, basically shooting enough people that I get better at talking. Which, when you think about it, is a weird way to conduct one's business. But, uh, hey, that's video games for you. So, yeah. Thanks again. See you next week.